Association of Jackson, Mark Snyder. Hi, Mark. Morning. Good to see you both. Thanks uh, for having us back. How are you? Good. It's been a great winter so far. A well, little snowy this morning, but otherwise. Can we fine. go? Can we go back outside and take a look at the snowfall real quick? There's a little uh, bit falling. What the <laughs> heck is going that's, on? That's, that's wow. heavy snow. Jeez. Um, Brandon was talking. He forgot to send uh, Barrett with snow pants and boots. <laughs> I have to make an arrangement here. I know what that's like. Well, all I have to do is go to the lost and found table in the lobby and get a selection. Of, help yourself. Yeah. Yep. Well, help you'll yourself. be safe traveling. There's enough salt down out there now yes. to hold us for the rest of the winter, I think. We're good. Well, it'll be raining by the afternoon. That's so. what we hear. It seems like, uh, is the show earlier this year? No, it's about the same time as uh, last year. It, years ago, we used to have it later in March, and the dates sometimes conflicted with weather and mm -hmm. what was going on. And we found that since we've moved to February, things work a lot better. So end of the month, 23rd, 4th, and 5th, which will be not this weekend, but the next weekend, we'll be down mm -hmm. at the American One Event Center at the fairgrounds, which, of course, is a great facility. You're going to do the uh, gals night again? We are. Ladies night's a big part of the deal. Uh, Susie Mulvaney, our executive officer, has set that up. Uh, she's got prizes coming from Salon 517. There's going to be wine from Cherry Hill. Gilbert's Chocolates and the ladies will be invited to come down on Friday from 5 until 7 and, you know, involve themselves in that. Mm -hmm. uh, the ladies uh, make the decisions. Huh? Anyway, ladies make the so decisions. They're a very important part of what goes on around absolutely. the Absolutely. And uh, Heather, Co or Heather Dunnigan Co. has sponsored those through the cabinet house or Fair the enough. cabinet shop. And she's going to be our sponsor for that event. So people will have an opportunity to take part in a lot of things down there as well as just to be down for the show in mm -hmm. general. Let's take a look at some photos from uh, last year's show. Give you a little preview of what you're going to see. No snow last year either. No. No, we were lucky. No snow. This is going to be an exceptional show. We've got it full this year. Susie's even had to put people out in the lobby as you see in the pictures here. Every space has filled up early. And uh, we've got a big cross-section of different types of businesses that are going to be represented at the show. Uh, people looking to do any kind of construction or home improvement or repairs. Oh, who's there? It's Tina. There. Hey, Tina. You never see Tina from the waist down. Uh, no, <laughs> Tina, there's, yeah, Tina's usually just doing the weather for us. Um, wow, so the whole space is filled Everything's up? Everything's full. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Once again, consumers, as we see here on the screen, is, is our primary sponsor for the show. We have a number of silver sponsors. We've had a great deal of support from the community on this thing. It's been a successful show in the past, and uh, it's well attended, and there's every reason to come down this year. It's been, uh, you know, for home builders, a boom town and boom year with uh, the demand. Demand has been very good, yeah. It, you know, the, we're really blessed here to have some awfully good contractors. Yeah here in this area. And they're busy. I mean, uh, you know, we hear nationally that things are off, but mortgage rates have come down and there are homes being built and a lot of remodeling and mm -hmm. repair work being done. And typically the good contractors are all busy. Mm -hmm. You know, we suffering sometimes from lack of help. Sure. You know, as we hear in other industries. But things are good. We've had a good year. When, uh, our members certainly seem happy. Mm -hmm. Is there anything new, uh, a new vendor, a new booth that you're excited about? There are a number of them that have come in from really across the country. Mm -hmm. uh, with our exposure on the internet as a show here, we've got people coming in that represent a number of different things. It's, but, but primarily we're interested in supporting the local yeah. contractors. Yeah, it, it'll be a real diverse show this year. I think people will find it worthwhile to be down there to see all of that stuff. Um, the Blooney bin will be out on Sunday mm -hmm. for the kids. Nice. So there's reason to bring them down Sunday. We'll be there from 10 until 3. And uh, tickets are around. We've got them scattered all around town. There are free tickets. Or anybody can get in our website, that being jacksonhomeshow.com. Okay. And they can scan a 50-50 ticket in their phone and just show that at the show and get... Uh, a couple in for five dollars. It's otherwise it's going to be only five dollars a head, and children are free. Uh, and of course, veterans are always free. Awesome. Yeah. So it's it's a, a real well attended event, and we've got a lot of reason to be happy about it this year. Yeah, as you said, uh, kids will enjoy the balloony bin, but bring the whole family. There's things for 
everyone in the family to see and do all weekend oh, there's long. there's plenty to yeah, do. Absolutely, you know, and they're, they're all the little, everybody's got a bowl of candy out or mm -hmm. a pen or something that the kids like to get involved in. That's just part of the fun down there. It's a good place to get those uh, wooden yardsticks. I need new pens, actually. New pens. Oh, refrigerator magnets. Right? Oh, those yeah. are good they're as well. Good. They're always a good deal, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Never have enough of those, I found. No. <laughs> I saw that putting green, so it looks like, you know, that would be a good spot for the kids to hang out. Yeah, the landscaping displays are always nice. There's yeah. a ton of work that goes into those. Your uh, brother, as you know, has one of these in his house. Oh, I certainly <laughs> do know that. <laughs> I see. You've heard about it. I've <laughs> yeah. seen it. Yes. You're not allowed to touch it, but it's... God, you're not allowed to no, look at it. You wouldn't <laughs> want to wear it out, you know, that big don't investment even, Don't even glance at no, it. No, no, no. <laughs> Have you th uh, you've done a lot of remodeling. Yeah, I years. have over the yeah. years, you know. I mean, I think a lot of people, uh, you know, if you find the house that you want to be in for a long time, um, you know, it over time sense. you're sick of looking at the same stuff, right? Well, I, you know, I'm in the same boat. I bought my house, I don't know, 35 years ago or something, thinking it would be a good temporary spot or right. whatever. <laughs> and it's a great neighborhood and it's close to town and it's all the things we want to have. Mm -hmm. and it, and it makes sense to update and keep those houses going. Mm -hmm. And the other thing is, is values increase. It sure. certainly pays to take care of a house that you have. Yeah. And you're just more than helping your investment then. And good contractors are a good way to take care of that investment. Mm -hmm. what, uh, what's new in design trends and colors and... Uh well, like I think that. that has a lot to do with what's on HGTV. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, in any given, I, uh, lately we hear a lot about um, uh, shiplap, of course, everything has to be shiplap mm -hmm. now, and painted gray. Gray is the in color this week, or however mm -hmm. that all works. But the, you know, those shows do have a lot of influence on what goes on, and you see these very attractive homes, and people get ideas. I need to go down to the mm -hmm. home show and talk to somebody about that. So flooring, you see a lot of, you know, how many years ago was it none of us ever saw vinyl flooring anywhere? And now it's all over the place. Mm -hmm. So, of course, we have people like Christophs that are down there with vinyl flooring yeah. and, and others, you know, that'll be showing that those types of items. A lot of great, uh, a lot of great people, a lot of great well, there's uh, Ted right businesses. There. There's Ted right there. Yeah, there he is. Taking someone's credit card. No, oh, he's, that's Ted. Ted yeah. is giving someone I'll a give gift, oh, right. I believe. Yeah. But Ted's great. Yeah. Here's the event one more time. Again, it's coming up. It's next weekend. Yeah. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And uh, again, visit Jackson Home Show. Dot com. We hope to see you there. And remember, ladies' night is Friday night. Friday night. Yep. Cool. Five to seven. Mark, thanks so much for being with us. Thanks for having me. Nice to see you both. Mark Snyder from the Home Builders Association of Jackson. More of the show right after this.